Hi everyone, welcome to Theme Squad. Today in this video training, I'll show you how you can create a beautiful carousel on your DB theme based WordPress website. In this video training, I'll use a free carousel module so you won't have to spend any money. So now let's begin how we can create a carousel like this. Well, friends, I'm on the dashboard of my WordPress website. To install the module, I'll have to go to the plugins and click add new here you can see search plugin option i'm going to search for wow db and here goes wow db carousel light version i'm going to click install now button click activate by now we have successfully installed and activate wow carousel for db light plugin well friends now here goes my website and i would like to add the logo carousel or image carousel below this here okay what i'll have to do i'll have to enable the db visual builder here you can see just click here now i'm here and i'm going to create a section over there you can see the green icon okay below a section okay I'm going to click over here on this blue button to create a section, a regular section and a one column row. Okay, great. And I'm going to scroll down to get the expected module. Here it is. Wow, image carousel. I'm going to click over it. And here it is. And here is the panel for wow image carousel. What you will have to do, you will have three options content design and advanced under content you will have option to add images so first of all add new item that means an individual image if i click on the plus sign and here you can see it allows me to add content i'm going to click over here and here you can see upload image just add image now i'm going to select files and select all the images at a time okay i'm going to start with this image just select it and click upload on image and here you can see it is added so i'm going to scroll down and here you can see title you can add title but the problem is if you add title that will be visible here say for example title that's here okay so i'm going to avoid this i'm not going to add title and scroll down and here you can see link opportunity you can add link to this image okay i'm going to link to this page and here goes the link target in the same window or open new tab if you add any link all i select the second option in the new tab and here goes background color option you can add background color but i don't recommend so i'm going to click here to reset it and admin level it is not important okay friends we are done with the content part and here goes design if i click over here here you can see image you can increase or decrease the image height but leave it default and image hover animation flash okay and okay i'm going to avoid the animation and you can add overlay color you can add any content okay that's fine so go to the advanced part and here we have nothing to do okay let's get back to the content again and we are done so what we can do we need to add another images some more images so here you can see an arrow icon just click over here and will be sent here on the main panel and now here you can see a plus sign you can add new item or you can duplicate this one okay uh, i'm going to click here to add new item and here you can see content i'm going to choose another image just this one and i'm not going to add title i have showed you how to add link so i'm not going to do the same job again what i'm going to do i'm going to quickly add some images well friends i have added six images so it's more than enough now let's scroll down and here you can see carousel settings 
okay i'm going to bring it anywhere so that you can see it clearly okay i'm going to leave it here so carousel setting if i click on it and here you can see animation speed you can make the animation faster or slower and here goes autoplay autoplay means it the carousel will play automatically and autoplay speed you can control it and here you can see the navigation and besides navigation you can add pagination navigation pagination here you can see on the bottom pagination or you can add navigation and pagination at the same time okay here it is but i'm going to select navigation and here you can see options to slides to show here you can see at a time it shows three slides i'm going to increase the number to five okay now it looks cool or you can choose four that's cool okay now you can just increase the slight spacing okay that's all okay let's see what we have in the design tab here you can see carousel you can just uh, carousel spacing carousel spacing top carousel spacing bottom okay you can add a space on the top you can add a space on the bottom okay and scroll down here you can see navigation you can uh, just add a style to the navigation here you can see height here it is height you can increase or decrease the height okay and icon size here you can see arrow icon you can just increase the size of the icon also and icon color you can change the color i'm going to turn it to white and background color to this color so you can see it looks great and here goes a lot of options you can add border and border type is solid and for pagination you will see also some options okay you can change the color of the pagination you can add height width etc okay well friends uh, hope this is enough for this training and uh, i could show you how you can create an image carousel on db theme based wordpress website when you are done just click over here and hit save button i'm going to visit my site to see scroll down and here you can see the nice carousel okay in the same way you can add image carousel in your db theme based wordpress website hope you enjoyed this video training if this video helped you don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my youtube channel